I'm Naturalist Marty. Let's go find this telephone pole growing in the wild. This juggernaut of the timber industry also produces pulp for paper. Let's take a look at how to identify the eastern white pine, Pinus strobus, also known as the northern pine and soft pine and Weymouth pine. It can grow over 80 feet, eastern part of North America and up into Canada, well-drained soils, acidic soils. It uh, loves uh, full sun, but it can tolerate shade. It's fast growing, so it's a soft wood, fast growing 12 to 18 inches a year. If you look at these feathery plume-like needles and you grab a clump, you'll find out that each cluster, also known as a fascicle, is broken into five needles. Look at that. That's called a fascicle. That cluster, again, has five needles, and this is the only pine east of the Rocky Mountains that has five needles in its cluster. Here's the seed cone. And if you take a look at the bark, it's gonna be dark, real blocky, and deeply furrowed if it's an older pine. It'll only be smooth, dark green, and actually pretty thin if it's a younger white pine. And that's how you identify the white pine, Pinus strobus.